this is Adrian from OPS News, and today I'm here with... Evan. And I have a couple questions for you. So, first question, um, how do you feel about uh, that we have to get the vaccine by December? I don't like it, because um, if we have to get the vaccine, that means that we have to organize our whole schedule for something else. Okay, and another question, how do you feel about the school uniform? Um, I say it's okay, but some people spend so much money on uniforms that like, they can't afford sometimes. Okay, and another question is, um, do you like the uniform or no? Yes. Would you rather wear the uniform or regular clothes? Uh, I'll say regular clothes because they're more comfortable than school uniforms. Okay, I agree with that. Um... This is Adrian from the OPS News. Back to you. Hi, this is Miguel from the OPS News, and today we'll be interviewing Giselle. So, first question is, do you think that there are any benefits to make your grade any higher by schools opening up? Uh, I do, because when we were in online school, I didn't really learn well, because it was hard to find the assignments and to see if I actually did them or not. But uh, in school... Uh, it's much better. So. Do you think every kid in school should be vaccinated? Uh, I don't really think that because I feel like it's our body and we should choose what we want to do with it. So. And final question is, do you, do you have any opinions about the schools opening up? Uh, I, uh, no, <laughs> really. Uh, it's much better. That right. That's good. So, this is Miguel from the OPS News. Now back to you. Hi, I'm Dakota for LPS News, and I'm with... Adair. And I'm going to be talking about um, the changes around the school since COVID. What do you have to say about that? Well, there's just been many changes, and it just feels weird being back in school. Mm -hmm. And, well, just the, having to wear masks and not seeing everyone's complete faces is, like, Weird, but at the same time, when, if if people didn't have their masks, it would also feel weird seeing their face. Yeah. Face. Anything else you would like to add on to that? No. Okay, thank you. I'm Dakota Corrales for LPS News. Back to you. Hi, I'm Jesse with LPS News, and I am today I'm interviewing Irvin. And today we'll be talking about going back to school during the pandemic. How do you feel about that, sir? Um, I feel like for some parents... It's very worrying because they, they're worrying about their kids, especially the ones that are younger than 12 because it's not vaccinated. And I guess for kids, I, some kids like it because they're going to get to see their friends. Interesting. What else do I say? All right, I have another question for you. Uh, would you rather be back at school or on Zoom? Um, back at school because I feel like I learn better here. Because over there I have like four siblings and they're always distracting me. Nice. Thank you, sir. Irvin. This is Jesse with LPS News. Back to you. Hello, this is Andrea from LPS News and today I'll be talking with... Kelly Ocampo. Okay, Kelly, today your first question is going to be, how do you feel about returning back to school? Um, I think that more students are being productive in school than in Zoom because we're in um, oh. Your next question is, um, what, do you, how, what do you think about kids un, um, 12 and older getting vaccines by December to remain in school? I think that's safer for the rest of the students so that no one gets less chances of people getting sick. Okay. Um, thank you, Kelly. This is Andrea from LPS News. Now back to you. Um, I'm Dulce, and I'm here with Helen. And um, today we're going to be talking about um, how it feels to be back in school and with like COVID and stuff. Um, Helen, do you think we should have got more time to come back to school? No, because like, it was like really boring at home. Um, do you think students should be vaccinated to come back to school? And why? Um, I don't know. It's their... their De how do you say decision? Decision. 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 Okay. 
Um, and why? Why do you think that? I don't know. It's their choice. Okay. Uh, um, do you like the new lunch rule where we have separate lunches? No, because like some of my friends are like in lunch B. Okay. Um, um, do you think um, we should be able to sit next to our friends during lunch? Yeah, because like we get to see them after school, so it's, there's like no point. Okay. Um, um, that's it. Huh? Thank you. Thank you for Bye. Your, thank you for your time, um, Helen. Um, back. Back to you guys. This is Rachel Bustamante for LPS News, and I'm here with Emily Cuevas. I'm going to be asking you a couple questions about how you feel about COVID and the situation we're going through. My first question for you is, what do you think about the COVID vaccine being mandatory? Well, I don't know. It's like any other vaccine, to be honest, but it's just weird how it came out so soon. Yes. And that they're testing it. And that they're testing it. Sorry. Sorry. And that they're testing it already on us. Yeah. Okay, my second question for you is... <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Come on. I forgot. Okay. About... Wait. I forgot. <laughs> about my parents' opinions. Oh, yeah. What are your parents' opinion about the COVID vaccine being mandatory for schools now? Well, she thinks I should get it because, you know, it's good for me. But uh, she's also is worried about what are the outcomes it's gonna give me, like if it's gonna give me any um like any headaches or something. Yes. How do I finish it? Thank oh yeah. You. Thank you for watching LPS News. I'm Rachel Bustamante. Bye. <laughs> I'm Idelis Najera, and today I'm interviewing Kimberly Gonzalez. Okay. So my first question is, what are your parents' opinions on the vaccine? My mom wants me to get it and she thinks I will solve everything. Okay, second question is, what type of books do you look at the book for? I don't really read books. So okay. I don't know. Third question is, um, uh, oops, forgot it. Hold up. Should you be able to go to the restroom even though the teacher says no? Yes, because you can't hold it in. This is Idelis Nahira for LPS News. LPS News. Now back to you. Huh? Now back to you. Now back to you. Hi, my name is Sayami and I'm here with LPS News. Today I'm going to be talking about going back to school during COVID. What do you like or dislike about coming back to school during COVID? Um, I really enjoy coming back to school. I enjoy being back in the classroom, which we didn't have um, the opportunity to do last year. And I don't really have anything that I dislike. Do you have any worries about being close to students? Uh, I do have some worries because there are some kids who like don't wear their mask properly. But I feel pretty safe because we do sanitize in our classroom, which really helps prevent um, germs. Okay, thank you. This is LPS News. Back to you. Hello, I am Jose here with LPS News and I'm here with Christian. How do you feel about the school uniform? Well, I feel um, good because with the school uniform, like you don't have to worry about um, bringing other clothes. How did you feel the, about the first week of school? Uh, I felt kind of confused because I didn't know what to, where to go and and... And I was um, a bit confused with the schedule. Okay. This has been Jose from LPS News. Now back to you. Hi, I'm Evan, and I'm here with Adrian. Um, first question, what do you think about the school sports? Um, I think it's good. I think we should play a little bit more sports, but right now like we're taking it easy, so uh, it's all right. What do you feel about every player getting their vaccine? Um, I don't... Cause well, I don't think it's like that much good of a idea, but 
if we have to be safe then and we have to do that then that's okay with me what do you feel about the school buying the school uniforms um, or like the sports uniforms repeat that again what how do you feel about the school buying the the soccer uniforms or like well, any sports uniforms um i think it's good we can save money and yeah Um, I'm Evan, and um, we'll see you next time in LPS News. Okay. Um, this is Helen. I'm here with uh, LPS News. I'm um, this is Dulce. 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 Huh? Oh, Dulce Hernandez, Maria de la Cruz. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. My question is gonna be, what's your favorite TV show? Um. Right now, uh, I already watched it, but it was called Squid Game. Oh, and then the last episode. Yeah. Well, who's your favorite um, character? Um, el abuelito. Because <laughs> he's. Died. I know, but he's hot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, go. Thank you. go. Are you gonna do your oh, bye. Bye, chicos. <laughs> Um, hello, my name is Giselle Carbajal, and I'm uh, with LPS News, and I'm here with... Dayami. <clears throat> okay, so um, the first question is, how do you feel about having to take the vaccine soon in order to go to school? Um, a bit more protective, because we might have a lower percentage of getting COVID. Um, uh, have, have you enjoyed... In person school better than online school, or um, I do enjoy more in person than online because I get to be like with my friends and it's easier to ask the teacher for help. Okay, last question. Um, have you found any problems with uh, school that you want to mention? Um, I had no problems so far. Okay. So uh, this is just Alcaba from LPS News. Now I'm back to you. Hi, I'm Kimberly Gonzalez, and I'm here with... Miguel. Do you think uniforms are inconvenient? Um, yes, but sometimes no, because it honestly depends on the brand, because sometimes, like, your uniforms could be, like, really tight, and, like, they wouldn't have your size. But yet again, some other brands would, like, be really comfortable by the... What's it called? By the material they use. Would you rather have um, a free uniform Friday? Um, yes, so you could, like, you could say show off your fits, because sometimes I want to wear some, um, like, clothing that I like, but I can't since it's all uniform, so, yes. Would you think uniforms are good to have? Yes, because not only, well, first, cl sometimes clothing can be stressful to, like, f pick out, so uniform makes it easier for kids to, like, get ready for school. I'm Kimberly Gonzalez from LPS News. Back to you. This is Kelly Ocampo for LPS News, and we are here with... Emily Cuevas. I will be asking you two questions about school and what your opinion is. How do you feel about coming back to school? Um, I, f I don't know. I'm excited because I get to be with my friends, but I'm nervous about the whole COVID situation. Did you think it was better during Zoom? No, why should he? Yes, because it was more convenient. And now we have to make time for school. Okay. That's it. This is Kelly Ocampo for LPS News. Now back to you. This is Samantha for LPS News, and I'm here with... Jesse. Today I'm going to ask him questions about the school lunch. What, do you, what is your favorite meal? Nothing, because it's all gross. Oh. <laughs> One more question. Why do you not like the food here? Because it's terrible. This is Samantha here for LPS News. Back to you. This is Irvin for LPS News, and this is Adair. Um, and today we're talking about school. Do you prefer online school or in 
in person school? Uh, they both have benefits. Like, I would prefer to be online because, well, I don't have to pay attention. The teachers won't know if I'm paying attention or not. And in person, well, I have, it's, like, good being here and getting, like, to talk with other people again. But I have to wake up early. Okay, and um, what are the benefits of in-person school? The benefits are at least, well, I don't think it's a benefit, but um, getting to talk to people, um, not being by yourself, not being, like, in your house the whole time, bored, and yeah. Thank you, this has been, say your name. Uh, uh, this has been Irvin. This has been Irvin, Irvin for LPS News. Now back to you. Hello, this is Alaid for LPS News, and today I'm with... Irvin. So, I'm going to be asking Irvin some questions of how he feels about um, being back in school. So, first question is, do you prefer Zoom or being here in person? I prefer in person because during Zoom, I used to not pay attention because of my siblings used to distract me. So, second question is, what are some things that you like about being back in school? What I like is I get to talk with my friends, make new friends, and pay attention more. I get very great. And what are some things that you would prefer to be back in Zoom for? Um, maybe not waking up as early and not paying attention in class. <laughs> so the last question here is, what do you feel about having to get the vaccine to be back in school? Um, I don't know. I, I'm already vaccinated, so... Thank you. This has been Adair for LPS News. Now back to you. This is LPS News, and I'm here with Jose. Um, what what do you think about the school lunch schedule? It's good because it's a perfect time, so we don't need too early and too late. What is your opinion on the school lunch food? It's good. <laughs> this has been. This has been. Christian Cruz for LPS News. Now, um, back to you. Hello, my name is Keelan Aguilar, and I'm here with the LPS News, and today I'm going to be interviewing Kelly Ocampo. So, Kelly, what are your top favorite subjects here at school? I like math, science, and history. Why do you like those subjects? Um, I'm not sure. I just find them interesting. And my second question for you is... What is one favorite assignment or project you've done here at school? Um, I think my the labs we do in science class. Thank you so much. This is Keelan Aguilar from, L from LPS News. Back to you. My name is Diego here for LPS News. Today I'll be interviewing Esmeralda. Uh, I'll be talking about school lunch. How terrible is the school lunch? Very terrible. They don't give you enough options, and it just tastes disgusting. Okay. What's your favorite uh, meal at the school lunch? Uh, just the chips. Yeah, just the chips. This has been Diego for OPS News. Now back to you. Uh, hi, uh, this is for OPS News. My name is Kevin, and I'm interviewing... Manuel. <laughs> um, uh, today I'm going to talk to you about uh, COVID and how it affected you. So, how did it affect your family in any way? Nothing. They got the vaccine. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, like, how did what what were you doing during the pandemic? Playing games. Nothing. <laughs> this has been this has been Kevin for LPS News. Back to you. Hi, my name is Manuel Garcia, and I'm with LPS News. I'm here with LPS News, and I'm with uh, Kevin. All right, Kevin, today I have some questions for you. One question is, what is your topic about school uniforms? Do you like them and do you enjoy them? Yeah, they're not that bad. They're not that, they're not that uncomfortable. They're good to wear. All right, thank you. Another question I have for you is, um, how has, um, do you like the school uniform and do you like how you always have to wear it each day? And how, um, what is it called? Yeah. Yeah, well, uh, don't. I'm like, I don't really like wearing it every single day of the school week. And, yeah. All right, see. Thank you, Kevin. This has been Manuel Garcia for LPS News signing out. Hi, this is Jocelyn from LPS News signing on from 
from LPS News, like I just said. And this, and I'm here with Malia. 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 Sorry. And um, I'm here um, with uh, Malia. Um, how do you like your? No. Um, how, how was your experience with online school? Okay. If you had online school. It was okay. Did you like online school? Why or why not? I didn't like it because it was giving me bad grades, and at the same time, I liked it because I got to stay at home. This is Jaslyn signing off from LPS News. Hello, this is Alexander Gomez from LPS News, and I'm here with Alexander Hardinas. Today, we're going to be talking about the school schedules. Okay. If you were to change the school schedules, how would you change it? At fir first, I would change the morning to eight o'clock, to nine o'clock, instead of eight o'clock, to get more time to get ready. And after school, less time, like at two thirty. Okay. This has been Alexander from OPS News. Not back. Not back. Hello, I'm Mariani, and I'm here with Salvador. And I'm going to interview about school lunches. Uh, I don't really like it. I personally really never liked school food. Mm. I think school food could be healthier. Do you think the same? Yes. Do you think school food helps you concentrate in your studies? Uh, not really. I mean, food really doesn't help you a bit. Mm. Some people does. Thank you. This has been. This has been. Ariani. Ariani. For LPS News. For LPS News. Now back to you. Now back to you. Hello, this is Andres from LPS News. Today I'm interviewing Efren. So Efren, um, do you, what do you like about the schedule? Um, I don't really like the schedule actually. <laughs> it, it's confusing. I, the first couple of days, it was really confusing. I didn't know what lunch I had. They said I had lunch A, and I went to lunch B at the end. Uh, what do you dislike about the schedule? Uh, the times. It should have just been like we got our three. Um, it shouldn't like be odd numbers, like two thirty-two or something like that. Okay, this is Andres from LPS News. Now back to you. Hi, this is Andrew Luis with LPS News. I'm here with Andrew. Today we'll be talking about how <laughs> how to how do you feel about having having separate um, lunches? Um, uh, I like it, but like some kids uh, separated because there was uh, some of their friends were on the other lunch and then they were on a different lunch, okay. so separated like friends. Okay. My next question is, how do you feel about having to get the de the vaccines before December? Uh, I think it's good, so we could all sit next to each other and uh, we could be all like normal. Okay. Alright. How do I end it? This has been... This has been Andrew for LPS News. Now back to you. Hi, this is Ashley for LPS News and I'm here with... Justin. Okay, today, um, what are, have you gotten in trouble so far? Uh, like once or t twice, but like it wasn't like really detention. Like what, what happened? Uh, I spilled some hand sanitizer on the floor. <laughs> and it made me wipe it up. <laughs> um, how have these seven weeks been treating you? Oh, pretty tough. I have like B's and C's in my classes. Um. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> um, what are some struggles you've been <laughs> facing? Uh, I just I need to pay more attention in class. And you need to cut your hair too. This is actually from OPS New. Now back to you. Hi, this is Heidi with OPS News, and I am interviewing Arlen. Okay. Um, what do you think about vaccines? Um, I think they're safe for people to make people safe. Okay. Um, are you gonna get the vaccine? I already have it. Okay. Do you watch anime? No. Okay, that's it. <laughs> Back to you. you. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, this is Evelyn with OPS News, and I'm here with Ashley, and we're gonna be talking about uh, COVID. So. Generally, like in general, how did COVID affect you? It affected me because um, I realized that I'm very like 
I'm not like clean. I'm very antisocial. Well, not anymore, but I was. And so it, it made me go into hibernation. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, um, how did you feel about taking classes on Zoom? I didn't like them. I slept through most of them. So I had to screen record them. Shh, don't tell the teachers. You're saying it to a camera. They won't hear it. Um, okay. Yeah. Okay, um, and lastly, like if you, if you were like smaller, like younger, do you think that, did you ever think that this was going to happen? Would you ever think? No, um, I thought that I was gonna live a happy life. A happy life. <laughs> so, but then this happened, so it kind of, that gap of a year and a half is like missing, so I gotta get that back. Okay, thank you, Ashley. This is Alan with LPS News, now back to you. Hi, this is Andrew from LPS News, and this is Andrew. Um, did you learn more from in person or online? In person, because honestly, on online, everyone didn't pay attention. Like, everyone just went to sleep because, yeah, it's online. Okay. Do you prefer uh, online or in person, and why? I prefer in person because so you won't be seeing the same people every day, and yeah, instead of staying home because home is boring sometimes. Okay. This is Andrew from LPS News. Back to you. Hi, I'm Kimberly Gonzalez. I'm with LPS News and I'm here with... Miguel. Hi, that's Miguel. Do you think... You with LPS News? I'm here with... Christian. Um, hi, Miguel. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I, I forgot. Doing? Hi, Len. Okay. Um, why Can we start that over again? <laughs> Hi, I'm Kimberly Gonzalez, and I'm here with Miguel. Kimberly, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs>